A fresh political blame game has erupted over the violence in the British city of Leeds. And what is interesting is that the British politicians Nigel Farage and Alex Sobel are now involved in a spat over the rioting that has happened in Leeds. But before that, let's in fact take a look at some of these images that are coming in from the northern English city of Leeds. An angry mob went on a rampage on Thursday night, setting on fire a double-decker bus, smashing up windows and also overturning a police car. Now, the chaos broke out in Hare Hills, which is about 1.6 kilometres northeast of the Leeds city centre. Now, one of the clips also shows heavy police presence, but the officers are outnumbered by the large crowd of protesters. Another clip shows people throwing objects at a police car, including what looks like a scooter. Since the rioters wreaked havoc on the streets of Leeds, the Clacton MP and the Reform UK leader, who's got a reputation of being a bit of a motor mouth, Nigel Farage, took to social media, and this is what he said, and I quote him here, the politics of the subcontinent is currently playing out on the streets of Leeds. Don't say I did not warn you. Now, replying to Nigel Farad's social media post, the Labour Member of Parliament for Leeds, Central Alex Sobel, hit back saying that Farad simply knew nothing about the situation and had not been briefed upon it. Sobel said, and I quote, this is a situation that you know nothing about and no one has briefed you on. You're actually inflaming a situation with misinformation. The politicians have a responsibility to not exacerbate the situations, particularly when they have no knowledge of them. I expect you to issue an apology. This is what Sobel wrote. The disturbances began after social services reportedly took away four children from a family after the police responded to a disturbance call on the streets of Leeds. According to the authorities, the officers and the agency workers removed the children before the violence escalated throughout the evening. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.